I did not think they would just jump right into it, but uh... Maple, of course, hailing from... There we go. Alright, we're in. We're in. Zamo, I think, also doing the same thing that Hank was doing, with being a little too aggressive at the beginning of the game. Mm -hmm. And I think... Well, I think we'll see the difference in, like, how they adapt. That should be a kill. Uh, here we yeah, go. Yeah, yeah, that's Dang a kill. it. Maple up. Ice Climbers looking like the nice climbers, that's all I gotta say. Slowking looked absolutely dominant in their friendlies earlier. I think it's just a matchup knowledge thing, especially with like in the Midwest where we go, oh, what ice climbers do we have? Yeah. Like Jinji? Shout out to Jinji. Yeah, we got Unfortunately, Jinji. Unfortunate that they're not there. They're not here. Good up till um, I think Zamo also showing like a little bit more match knowledge immediately trying to go for that Nana kill. Yeah. Even though he's behind. Good shine, that should be it. Yep. One more. I don't like that. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. No, you just you can't let Sopo get away with too much shit. You just kind of. That should be a kill. I think that should have been up there. Honestly. Okay. Cool. What's up? Shane going on. Park you on the mics. Oh, I think that might be a Danana. Really good for Zamu, especially finding that early on. Wait for Kellogg to get here. Good sleep. Good sleep last night. I was really tired. Yeah, Zam is showing incredible adaptability. Very, very. Oh, yeah. Absolutely. Pressing this lead further and further. Waiting to ba baiting out those aerials, especially with those long. Ooh, yeah, Zamo absolutely flipping the script after that first stop. And yeah. back in a big way. He <laughs> ain't Parker out here. Parkable, or Parker, notable uh, Isis hater. See, that separation is exactly what I was talking about in the last game. Yeah, that should be a dead end. Yeah, th th this should be it. Zamo is showing way better magic knowledge than him, especially in the earlier on, and adapting very well to how Maple's plays. Uh, yeah, what an angle. You know, as a top, uh, top 40 player, he's got to be- Oh, that- Oh my god! He's insane! Yeah, that's a stop. Oh. Is he living? Oh, if he was with that. Sam, kind of chuckle a little bit. No way, no way, no way he, he knew what he was doing. <laughs> that falling up there. Sam was taking an early set lead, going up 1-0. Uh, this is top eight. This is, is winner set five. Uh, James yes. Was pushing yes. it back to top five. Yeah, this is top five. Oh, it is. I just echo. You want on the mics? Oh. <laughs> Switching to Peach. Zabu with a little bit of BM here, uh, showing their disdain for uh, you know ice climbers. Oh, oh, this should be a dead. Oh, good for Peach. Oh, this is absolutely destructive for Peach. Peach can down smash one of them and they can spoke. It's actually terrible. But Maple showing once again the handoffs. Zabu kind of with the lean forward. Maybe Zabu just didn't want to play Fox on FD to get tilted, so it's fair. What? It was all thousand. You went thousand. Oh, is yeah. that PM? It's yeah. in PM. Oh, I thought it was melee. I know, oh, man, no. I'm sorry. No, Did you idea. remember to split the recording? Yeah. I started a little bit late because they just jumped into it. I thought they were that's doing okay, hammering. Yeah. But, uh, yeah, no. Seven, as our resident Peach main, how's the Ice Climbers matchup for, uh, for Peach? Uh, it's interesting. Peach actually is able to camp Ices pretty well. Um, which is good in the matchup, obviously. Yeah. So that's a big advantage Peach has. On FD, what do you think? Like, do you, do you still think that it's a that way? Oh my god, that's how. No, we... it's harder. I think it's harder on this stage. This is a counter pick, in my opinion. I mean, it's a counter pick on almost every, on almost every matchup. There you go. Bro, I got snake slug dark. Good nair. Let's see yeah. another good nair. <laughs> Is Amo on the board? Let's see if they can adapt just as well as they did. Oh, oh, that turnip job is kind of nice. nasty. I think Zamu's just kind of throwing this game away. Honestly, uh, as we all know, Zamu notorious for going Fox and Rack and absolutely shitting on us. Good nair. On a good separation, though. Still showing that knowledge. Oh, let's see how... Good tech. Good tech. Thank you. 
This is a great matchup. Zelda, Zelda Ice is much easier in my opinion. FD is hard, but like... I still think you just, that... You just get to I don't think the Icy Zoom is as hard. Are you looking for Bracket? Are you looking for Bracket? I saw them go upstairs earlier, so... Oh no, he's over there! Tilted on a D. That's fair. Which I mean. This is best of five. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, top five best of five. Yeah, we. Yeah, I think we just got it. He was a. Uh, uh, Interesting turnip draw. Exactly what we want to see. Honestly, if, if Zamu gets this kill, yeah, uh, honestly, I think, I think Zamu has a chance now. Also, that mashing, absolutely stellar. Does not matter the matchup. Zamu mashing, absolutely insane. Good Nair. Did you bracket? What do you need? Peach? Yeah, I, I think... I didn't even realize it was Zamu. I honestly, I, I think, as a spacey player, if I'm playing a Ice in a best of five, I'm not I'm not sitting down for the whole FD game as a, as a spacey. I'll just, D, I'll just like, SD four times. <laughs> so, to go Peach, kind of, kind of a power move. This should be it, honestly. I, I think Zamu wins. Oh my god. After being down, full stock, then bringing it back. That sub, look at that. What, like, what, what can you do? What, what can Isis do there? Oh, back to Should be it, yeah. Good on Zamu. Honestly, I agree with the counter pick. I do not think that Spacey's on FD win. Yeah, uh, I do not think Spacey's on FD win nearly as hard. My B, my B. I was not told to update things. It's okay. Sorry, stream. I'm, I'm actually trash. No, you're. It, th these are just like the details. You're doing great. No. I'm, as long as you I'm, split the recordings, you're doing great. Okay. What? Well, how do you think Peach fares against Ices on Stadium versus FD? Dude. Also, the the custom the custom yeah. skin. Kind of. Oh yeah, yeah. Um, I don't know. Honestly. The, the shorter ceiling, um... No, I meant the skin. I don't give a shit about... No, no, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, just, I'm just fucking... The shorter ceiling, honestly, I'm trying to think, though. Like, how often do Ices kill you off the top? That's what I'm saying. So, like, do you just think it's a platform thing, then? It, it's gotta be. Do you think platforms benefit, uh, like, at least the side platforms benefit Ices more than they benefit Peach? Um... Because I think top plat really benefits Peach. I think it kind of goes either way. So yeah, no, I, I agree. I, I think with these platforms, it's a little harder to say compared to, like, the battlefield, like, the tri-plats. Yeah. But Dude, I mash, would rather just go to, like... That match was... I heard it. God. I wonder if they could hear that on stream. They could. I hope they could. Zamu absolutely mashing out of his board today. There's a mic over there. It's, it's got to be picking it up. <laughs> it's got to be picking it up. Uh, can you hear the players right now? Uh... Tato, uh, you just missed it. Ma or Maple may. This is top eight. Uh, Maple B. Uh, Zamu counter picked Peach and yeah. took FD. Okay. Did you win? No. God damn it. <laughs> okay, I gotta go play. Stream. See you later. Who'd you play, Shane? Trey John. Oh no, I was playing. I was playing uh, Maple earlier. They were absolutely decimating me. I didn't even know. So I was playing Maple and Sloping earlier, and I did not realize how cracked they were. Also, I didn't. Realize it was sloping maybe. Oh wait, so Zamu ended up winning game one? Oh uh, game two. Oh uh, as Peach. Why does it say two oh Zamu? Test of five. I thought you said Zamu lost the game. Good, good, good. Yeah, yeah. Uh but I think Zamu's showing a little bit more matchups. Uh, they went Fox so Zamu went Fox game one. Uh -huh. Did absolutely stellar. Uh-huh. Um brought it back 
from a one stock deficit to three only or three stock in them, and then game two was down a oh, full stock as Peach uh, on empty, and then brought it back as well. Yeah. This game it does not look near as close, so I think that with it, it, it being Zamu's Caterpillar pick, they'll probably go back to Fox. Yeah. Also the. Uh, Where is that thing? Oh, oh, bottom, oh, this one. Yeah. Yeah. All right, I'm gonna go play my set. Oh, Boom! Oh, uh, uh, yeah, Trey John. All right, game four, back to Dreamland. But as Peach this time, destroyed him with rocks. It's kind of crazy. Yo. Up next, Alex is looking. Uh huh. I wouldn't mind hopping on. Absolutely, you can hop on now, dude. Uh, I want to do it for his sake. Okay, cool. Really knows who Alex is besides just a really good player. Well, you can always jump on, like, but no rules. I appreciate it. Yeah. Yeah, so game four, Zamu Maple, Peach on Dreamland, one of Peach's fave stages. I don't really know what I'm looking for. I guess just Peach kind of ruins Icy's life. I don't know. They played Dreamland game one. They did. Yeah, I don't know. That's weird. Trey John is there. Yeah, Trey John's here. We just played in bracket. He destroyed me, but I'm gonna call it a close 2-0. I'm not afraid to take a stand. Uh, I, I thought I played pretty well. Uh, but yeah, Trey John just destroyed me, and now Trey John is playing Mario, Falco player. Yeah, dude, Maple's hanging on to these stocks like nobody's business. <laughs> I know. How was Zayn able to come back here, ladies and gentlemen? I don't know, yeah, maybe Maple didn't mind. I mean, look at this. Oh, in the back air. Peach hits him with the booty. Man, I wish I had some water. I'm also probably going to leave after this because I'm tired. Yeah, me too. I was waiting for Kellogg to eat here, but... Uh, yeah, where the hell is Kellogg? It's 10 o'clock. Yeah, you're asleep. So, I know Peach... Xander's kind of playing on the ground a little bit right now, but I'm pretty sure, unless I'm wrong, I think Peach can straight up just, like, float camp Ices. Um, I mean, obviously this is working. But, yeah, I don't know. We don't really have ice since it's Springfield. I didn't even know Zamu. When I talked with Zamu at last year's Sunshine, um, he told me he loves Fox because, because Fox has no losing matchups. Um, but it looks like he preferred Peach. What? He said he said he plays Fox because Fox has no losing matchups, and uh, he's a Fox believer. Wants to play a good character. He's just you know. Inspiring Peach. Yeah, I, I do remember listening to that part. Of it. Yeah. <laughs> no, this is looking pretty solid for Xanu though. Looks like he can close out, close out this set. But ice climbers are scary. They got that weird magic. The handoffs. To me, it's magic. Ooh, meaty. Oh my god, big F smash. Dude, I already said this in the last Maple set, but something of, everyone talks about like melee sound design and how satisfying like Falco's dare is, you know? I love the ice climber hammers, dude. They just they have such a satisfying sound effect. Yeah, I like so what Shofo just move around. Like, yeah. Like his grab, or I think it's a he, I don't know, but. His oh. Grab is really also, Ice Climber's down smash is one of my favorite moves in the game because it's so cheap. Yeah, if it was just Shofo and he's better, that would be good. Cool. Like yeah. No, I'm thinking of bringing out Ice Climbers against uh, Pugs because Pugs is. I mean, we haven't played in a while, but last time he played, he kind of gave my Marth the work. But when I brought out my ice climbers, I just like destroyed because <laughs> I don't think he knew them, how to play the characters at all. But yeah, Maple's keeping it close. I mean, one good, one good grab, one good big meaty F smash. Oh, here we go. This could be bad. Oh, Zamu gets out of it. And Zamu goes for Sopo here. Yeah, Nana dies. So. <laughs> This is pretty tough for Sopo, but not on not unwinnable, but because Peach is like can just trade you to death, like this is pretty rough for Sopo.
thrilling melee right now. Three, three minutes left on the clock. I mean, yeah, like, what is Ice Climbers? Oh, wait, here we go. Here's, here's a grab. Goes for a re-grab. Goes for up smash. Well, oh my god, here we go, here we go. Yo, is he gonna do it? Oh my god. Maple's fighting to his last breath. It's gonna take a while. It's gonna take a while, but it's it's really not impossible. I don't know what the edge guard sofa would have on Peach. I don't imagine it's very good, but Oh, Mr. Saturn, don't put that shield up. Yeah, it goes in for the dash attack. So Mr. Saturn, if you have your shield up, will I don't know if it automatically deletes shield, but it like gets it basically broken. So you gotta be careful. I've seen him win these, what a wiener. Dude, I, I believe in Maple right now. This is scary though. Yeah, any hit from Peach now, if it doesn't kill, it'll lead to an edge guard. But Sopo's a little floaty, you know, he could live. He could live a little while. Oh, I like how we have the state flags too. That's awesome. Up air just misses. But Maple keeping composure. Oh, here we go. Up air. Five gets five percent. Oh! There we go. Maple staying alive. Another up air, 69%. Does Zamu wield the magic of 69 and close out the set, or does Maple find an answer? He's got about 90 seconds to do it. A little over 90. Ed edge cancel. Oh, back air, back air. Okay, here we go, here we go. And up air. Oh, air dodges out. Smart. This is scary. And there we go. Zamu takes it. Zamu takes it. All right, I don't know how to do any of this. All you gotta do is stop.